visited the STEM engineering class to hear about their new laser and how it is being incorporated into a student's final project. We just got a laser this year. Um, it's definitely been a blessing to the actual program. We've been able to not only engrave different designs that kids either find on the internet or draw themselves, but we've also been able to cut out a lot of different materials. Um, We've helped make some gifts for different teachers and different people within the building. We've had some students make a complete arcade game using the laser so that they could have like a mini arcade system. Um, I have some other kids using acrylic right now. It'll use all separate, all different types of materials to further along the progress of our project. So this year, instead of doing the monogram letters like we used to, we instead decided to do clocks because the entire face of the clock, clock hands, and whatever else can be made using the laser, one of our 3D printers, or potentially the CNC machine. This is my project, my final project. We had to make clocks, and I made two parts, and I also used the laser template to engrave the Roman numerals onto my clock. And to do that, you have to go on to a thing called Illustrator on the computer and make a template. And then you send it to our teacher, who's Miss Mo, and she lasers it onto the clock itself. And then after, I painted it and then stained it, and now this is my final project. So I've been taking STEM for a couple years, and I'm really excited about the new equipment because we just got a new laser engraver that basically can engrave anything onto your wood or your plastic, so you can do a lot more with it and it makes everything look more professional and custom made that you couldn't do without the laser. So I'm pretty excited to use it for my final project. So my final project is a LED acrylic sign. So what I need the laser engraver for is to basically engrave like a logo. So I was thinking like doing a favorite sports team. And then um, it has a light at the bottom that basically lights up the whole plastic acrylic. And so you can really see the emblem or the logo. And it looks really cool. Signing off with WMHS News. This is Shiraz Kunzel, Jesse Seppi, and Anna Croft.